<laughs> He's crazy. Good morning, guys. Oh, damn it, my sock. Uh, we are going to a. Um, I was actually invited with Allie's class um, to a wine tasting. Is that what we're doing? Yeah. Go to a wine tasting place. You can get drunk at 9 a.m. <laughs> yeah, it's really 9 a.m. right now. Um, and we're kind of late, so we're kind of rushing, so I'll put this away right Good stop at the bakery. In the autobus alley. We're getting on the autobus. Autobus. We're going to a winery at 9 a.m. It's gonna be fun. Ali's gonna get drunk on wine and then go to class. And take a quiz. Yay. Hey, what's that on your hand? <laughs> Oh, that's just my engagement ring. <laughs> I'm just gonna get married, it's not a big deal. Yeah, you know, just some guy. Some random guy. As you say, man, I was never We get to watch Ocean's Eleven, too. We're the sun. We're in the Kenna. We're gonna go to a wine tasting. Right, Shelby? We're in the Kenna. The Kenna. It's pretty cold. It is kinda cold. Ah! Of, course, watch out. of course, in the middle of the road. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> it's funny if I go this way. It's funner. It's more better. <laughs> it's more best. More better. Whatever. Apple just needs funner in a It's funnest. Is it the funnest? It's the funnest to say ever. Do you like me? Cold. Woo, it's cold. Oh, it's the coat of arms. A uh, way that they would identify, in kind of a lazy way, the noble person. When you see the seal, you know whose house it is, whose family it is, based on what the seal looks like. Because they couldn't read, but they identified symbols. I'm learning stuff. <laughs> Gato. <laughs> oh, Gato. He's got a little lingerie over there. I guess that's for grandma. Somebody just look at look at all the little like that's right over there, look at yeah. all the laundry. Yeah. Dude, what the hell are you doing with the cat? Spanish Whose cat cats. is it? Whose cat is it? It's my okay. cat. Oh, yeah. See, it's the my owner cat. surprisingly just wandered off. You are so cute right now with that cat. It's such a Gatito! It loves you. What a sweetheart. Hi, so you're gonna be on YouTube. I'm gonna call you YouTube. Wow, it's really cold down here. This is weird. It's like a Disney cave. <laughs> Except it's legit. We're underground. I think so. You what did I say? You called Check. Me. You called Check. Me. These are crazy. Look at these crazy caves. Mild oh claustrophobia. God. They didn't even ask anybody if they were claustrophobic. Yeah, I know. That's kind of a necessity here. Look at this. It's this crazy. It reminds me of a uh, GoldenEye 64 in the caves. Ooh. I need to wash the winery and how the ones are in the like. You want a cookie? There were dead people in here. Yes. No. <coughs> so many caves. Scary. This is from 15, what? 15 what? 1535. 1535. And you saw the simpleton, and his symbols were the crown and the bird with the branch. It's like this, etched in there. Look at that. Yeah. And this was this was here, obviously, 200 years before America was discovered. And uh, this was an oil container, and it, it had like a little plug at the bottom. So. That's where they, they put like a varnish on the inside so the oil wouldn't leak out. So this was down in this See, They should have just came here instead of Iraq. That's where they put all the wine. That's all the wine. That's yummy. Ah, we're free. What is that? <laughs> Slightly messy. This is so good. Okay, so Al. What is that creepy fountain of old guys? That's the fountain of old men. I don't know what's going on. They are mad creeping on everybody here. There's just a fountain of a bunch of, literally a bunch of old men just chilling. The youth to come back. It's the fountain of hopeful youth. <laughs> old guys. We have a few brave girls who have gone to uh, sit by the fountain of creepers. And I, I don't know how they, uh, how this is 
playing out for them. Someone is letting me go now. I don't want to get hit by a car. How's this situation playing out for you? Um, it's great. They're not talking about us at all. I mean, that one's totally staring at me. Oh, good. Oh, good. Oh, good. I think I should just say hola to everyone. Should I just say hola to everyone? Hola. 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 We have to go get some wine now. We went to dwell in some caves for a bit. And I got it all on my hair, too. I've been peeling it out the whole time. We are at the winery. Vinery. The, vi the vinery. Yes, so we're going to get some wine. And you guys are going to see how it's actually made. And champagne. What was the other thing? Uh, some liquor and some sparkling wine. Mmm, yummy. Apparently Zorro was filmed here. Antonio Banderas. It smells like hardcore vinegar. It's awesome. You need to invent like a smell of vision for you too because it smells so hardcore right now. So they were saying that this is kind of like what a chateau would be in France, like they, this is called a pago in Spain, and they don't get grapes from anywhere else. They have 12 vineyards here, and they use only grapes from their own vineyards. It's really cool. That's where they ferment. Well, no, this is, yeah, this is how they make champagne. They call it cava, and they basically put like white wine, and they put, they put a cap like this, and they put yeast in it to do a second fermentation to give it the bubbles, and they keep it like this, and then after a few years, however, a couple years, or one year, however long you need it, they put it like this, and they freeze all the yeast in there, and then they have a machine that like takes it out. What I'm saying is that you... No puedo creer lo que aquí hacen todas las botellas a mano. Make all their bottles by hand. It's so cute. Oh, the cat keeps falling. <laughs> totally different cat. All right, this room definitely smells of wine. I think Ali and I might get some bottles of wine to celebrate. Cleans out the nostrils. I put some hair on my chest. I got hair on my chest now. It's good. It's closer to 80. Don't say to anyone that you're drunk. Let's drink it. I don't even know. It's fire. Yeah, it's still burning. Yeah. Oh, fuck. You feel like you're breathing fire, don't you? I can't even drink it. I can just drink it. 75. Okay, that was 80% alcohol. How much is on that? Five. There's 65% so in your hand more sanitizer. In that. Allie drank hand sanitizer essentially. 10% stronger <laughs> than normal hand sanitizer. This is a machine that separates like the individual grapes from the bunches. And those are all the wines. Do you guys remember seeing the viral video with the lady stomping on the grapes and falling on her butt? Oh my god, so, so funny. She's That's like, right. oh, 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 oh. Just make the grapes. Baby grapes. Do you think I'm allowed to? <laughs> Allie getting distracted with the cat again. They put all the kava to make the yeast settle in the bottom. There's spiders all in it. Oh, spiders. But they, they never kill the spiders, they always leave them. Oh, pretty. Those are all bottles. Allie's just opening up random gates. <laughs> Check it out, you guys, that's all yeast down there. You. You. <laughs> so cool. Time for the tasting. Maybe we should get a bottle. Do you want to get a white one, a red one? Let's get champagne. Champagne. We should get some champagne. This is the liquor that's made out of actually gr the, the red grape skin, which is kind of crazy. I didn't know you could do that. First pressing is so toxic that if you drink it, it would kill you, so they have to distill it twice. Yep. Sitting in the ground of a bodega. Tell everyone where we are, Kathy. Turn it around. Hey, it's Richard Gere. Hey, we got a pick of you guys, serious? Oh my god, pick of you guys. Yeah, you, wait, wait. Wait, is this plastic? Yeah, it's glass. Okay. okay. You all got your camera? It's not bad. It's good. And congratulations. Yay! It's funny, you guys. I'm still getting used to the commas instead of decimals. If you see a decimal, that means thousands. If you see commas, that means like 1190. Well, that one's a mistake. It kind of scared me for a little. I thought it was like seven, four, like seventy-eight hundred dollars. Looks like um, they're getting a lot of business from us. <laughs> Instead of being Coca-Cola, like Diet Coke, 
It's Coca-Cola light. Okay, so Allie's in class for the next uh, hour or two or something like that. So this is going to be my first attempt to try to find our apartment without her trying to direct me. So, uh, it's going to be interesting. It's 3.02 right now, so let's see how long it takes. It is now 3.11, so it took me nine minutes. Awesome. Guess where we are? Are we in a museum? High school. Oh, yeah, we're in a high school. I forgot. What the hell? My high school didn't look like this. Dude, this is like, this is beautiful. This is like, it looks like an old Roman house. Like, that this used to be the little bath, like the little atrium area. And they have like a watchtower. Like, why, what, what did I do wrong? Tell me what it is or what you think it is. First, describing the, the building inside. And, well, which teams? We're going in a cave I have, under high school. We're going into this. Dungeon cavernous darkness. Okay, really big step. Whoa. Oh, we're plunging into darkness and there's no light in here. Jesse's got a headlamp. Ah! Is it wrong for me to say that I'm very afraid right now? Like, I cannot see my hand in front of my face. You should see some light like, pop up, man. Don't oh say my. that. Put the lights, some lights, okay? Everyone here? <laughs> oh, sorry. No worry. This is like a horror Everyone movie. is here? This is like a horror movie. Is that? Can you oh see how creepy yeah. this is? This is crazy Why is that? Is There's a dentist chair. Are you serious? Just I don't know. I don't know why he's doing that. Why is that there? I don't know. I don't know. No idea. We should not. If we find the light, yeah, like the bar, some, some of you, yeah, some of you can go there. I, I don't know where, where, where the lights standing. are. Like, no. where? which? That's like Spain. A tunnel. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, like, Let's not go down there, okay? Don't separate. Point it this way. Like don't separate. Yeah. This was apparently a bomb shelter, um, like during the Spanish Civil War, and this shit's scary as ah I'm just telling myself it's like Ninja Turtles, and then I don't get scared. I still get scared. Who am I kidding? Oh, good. We're around the torture chair. Okay, so we were just in the bomb shelter, and that was really scary and all, because it was an old bomb shelter and like a torture place when Franco's regime was crazy, and they captured all the Republicans and tortured them and all that good stuff. Uh, and now we're locked in here. Sleep in the bomb shelter. It's gonna start raining. And it, yeah, it's gonna rain. It's gonna storm. And we're gonna have to go back in the bomb shelter at night. And then we're gonna have creepy, creepy stuff happen. Allie's done with class. Time to go meet up with her and see what else we're gonna do today. I bet she's gonna be exhausted. So I don't know. We're gonna see what's going on. Let's see if I can make my way back. It's 5:30, 5:40. See if I can make my way back. <laughs> oh, now it goes. Then she's singing the whole, she was like singing for the past two and a half minutes. I turned the camera on, she's done. For uh, some random pizza place that we found, we're gonna go check it out. Um, oh, that all that way. Amigos de Valencia blog and Twitter. Pues mis amigos me han dicho que este es un restaurante muy, muy bueno. What is this out? This is cheese fondue with some spices and you mm. stir it, stir it, stir it, and you eat it. And it's bubbling. bubbling. It's so Look at the good. bubbles. Mmm. Aquí tenemos pizza de vegetales. O verdura, lo que sea. Y pizza de cuatro quesos. Mucho cuatro queso. Mucho queso. Mucho mucho queso. We're gonna be like blowing our nose for like a year after this. Ellie's trying to figure out the washing machine. Is this seriously what it's gonna be? <laughs> Go for five seconds and stop? That's not gonna wash my clothes. That's weird. Weird. Today was a long day, wasn't it, you guys? We went cave diving or dwelling, and Allie got scared crapless. And I'm going to bed now. I'm gonna edit. I'm actually jailbreaking the iPhone 3GS. Finally has a jailbreak. So I'm doing that now, or at least trying to. It's a pain in the butt. So, uh, see you guys tomorrow. Yeah, I think, I think that sounds good. He's Charles, Charles Trippy, with Marley Zoe and his fiance Ali. You can watch him on his channel, avoid the indecision, cause the internet can't television.